Yes, my fans, it is your boy Bunny again. And I come here to share with you, my fans. I want to say a big, big, big respect to Mitchell Super, a YouTube blogger in Jamaica. I have just watched this video on YouTube where Mitchell Super have done from Trinityville to Mount Vernon. And as somebody who used to live in Mount Vernon and watching this video, I have to really talk about this video. So I want to dedicate this video to Mitchell Super, YouTube blogger in Trinityville, St. Thomas. St. Thomas. Now, the reason why I'm commenting on this video, I used to live at Mount Vernon in the 80s. And I can remember when I used to live at Mount Vernon, we used to have a bus, country bus. I'm not talking about minibus. A country bus used to run from Marant Bay, to Mount Vernon up at the school gate carry people from Marant Bay back and front and that bus called Mr. Roan bus used to drive up there there's two Roan you used to have two Roan you used to have two brother used to run bus one of them used to go up in the early morning run go to Kingston and one used to run from Marant Bay up there I think two or three trip per day for the day Miss to Mr. Ruan. Now, watching this video and seeing what I'm seeing now compared to when I was living up Mount Vernon in the 80s. Now, where I used to live up Mount Vernon is past the school gate, go further up, where you turn to go to Halbin Mountain. And I'm saying in the 80s, I drove a car from Trinityville through Mount Vernon, right through Top Mount Vernon, through Mangoro, Bethel, back to Cedar Valley. I drove a car in the 80s through that road. And seeing what I'm seeing now, and this road from Trinityville go up. When you leave Trinityville and go up, the first bridge that you meet up when you leave Trinityville and go up, just as you pass that bridge and go up the hill, there was a shop on the right hand side. That was my hunker shop. It was my father, my mother, brother shop. He was the pastor for the Church of God Church. And right through, I used to live. As you pass the Church of God Church, there's a shop to the left hand side, there's a standpipe. I used to live in a house on the left hand side here. You know, and when I look at this place now, I can hardly recognize the, some of the places them. But I can remember the area. And you know, it it the good thing about this place that I'm seeing. There's a lot of new development compared to when I was living there in the 80s. That tell me that people still love the era. People still take pride in the era. People still want to live in the era although there is no road to drive on. Now, my brother, I want to say again, a big, big, big respect to you. If you take your car, go up there to show us what from Trinityville to Mount Vernon look like now. Those bridge, those riverbed that they make the bridge them across, in my days, there was no bridge there. You used to have to walk in the riverbed to cross over. 
when rain fall and those river come down, we cut off. So if you out and the river come down, you don't have no chance of go up there because there was no bridge like those in my days for what happened. So seeing what I'm seeing now, I'm really happy for the people them that them have a bridge to walk on if the river come down. But God man, what is the government doing about these road? The type of house them that Mr. Billing up there, I lift my hand to the people who are building these houses. You know, it made me wonder how they get material up there to build these houses. But some way, them getting the material up. And I'm saying big up to every person who still live up Mount Vernon. And to the guy who you were talking to my fans, to the guy who you were talking to my brother by the school gate, I can't remember the name that he called himself, but I believe that that guy's name is Batman. Because I remember in my days, this guy Batman used to live across the road from the school. And I am not 100% sure, but this guy looked like Batman. He used to travel to farm work. So, you know, if that's Batman, and you're watching this video, or you hear about this, this, I would like you to hear your comments, you know, and big respect to your button. Because I know you from way back when you was doing traveling farm work and working up a Halbian Mountain. So as I said, I'm just wanna say a big respect to the YouTuber who really put himself out to bring out this video. I couldn't watch this video and no comments on it. It remind me of when Elite did do a video up a drone spin because I used to live up a drone spin as well and go to Trinityville School. And when I see Elite do this video and see what drone spin come to, I have to comment on it. So if you go on the channel and look, you will find that video that I do with Elite. And I'm saying, Elite, I'm going to speak to you for a while, but big up and big respect to you. And my brother, all I can say, keep on doing what you're doing. I watch most of your video that you do in Jamaica. I've been following your channel, I subscribe to your channel, and I will always for every person who do video in St. Thomas, as a person who born and grew in St. Thomas and come from St. Thomas, and seeing all these YouTube channels who is doing video in St. Thomas. Listen, a big respect to you. I live in the UK and I appreciate every YouTuber in Jamaica who I like in Jamaica. But for you lot in St. Thomas who is showing St. Thomas redevelopment and the upkeep of St. Thomas, a big respect to you. Everyone I know, I subscribe to the channel and I'm watching the channel 24 hours. So keep on produce the video and I'm looking for the video from the new Marant beer as soon as that start and I would love to see video Mangoro uh, Richmond Gap Richmond Nest Castle Grove so wherever you can go my brother go show a video just go and see them because we in the UK and watching back these video it just bring back memory to Jamaica so I want to say one more time, big, big respect to you. Keep up the good work. Keep doing the good work. And I said, thumbs up to you one more time. We take your car and this road up to, jo to Mount Vernon. Because I know the road is bad. The road is terrible. But just still make it up to the school. So one more time I said, I used to live past the school, go further up in the 80s. I live up there and go to Kingston and live. And from Kingston, I live 
and come to the UK. So, one more time I said, big up to you. Peace, love, happiness, and joy. One more time. One love to every person who live in a Mount Vernon. Every person who live in a Mount Vernon. One love to you. Because I know you have a long walk to come back to Trinityville. And a long walk from Trinityville to go to Mount Vernon. So, I'm out. Peace, love. Remember to like and share, comment and subscribe to the channel. Your boy Bonnie. Bless up. One more time. I'm out.